Hi, this is Tony Javier, owner of an Inc. 5000 rated real estate investment company. And in this video, which I'll try to keep under 10 minutes, I'm going to show you the number one marketing method that has put me on the map and is one of the biggest reasons that I've been able to do over a thousand flips in my real estate investing business and how every month I consistently get highly profitable real estate deals from TV commercials. Stick around until the end because I'm going to share the top benefits of TV and give you access to my formula. As you probably know, all businesses are driven by marketing and sales. And if you don't have a steady flow of qualified leads, then your business will die. And real estate investing is no different. It's all about the best motivated seller leads and finding them before anybody else does. And the best way to find motivated sellers that nobody knows about is TV commercials. I've seen other marketing channels come and go, but TV commercials have been by far the most consistent for me. And without TV, I feel like I would have gone out of business years ago because of how competitive real estate investing is now. Not only are marketing channels getting more competitive, but regulations are shutting down a lot of outbound channels like texting and cold calling. That is why inbound channels are the way to go. What is better than having sellers calling you instead of you having to reach out to them? So I want to show you how I get $5 to $10 back for every dollar I spend on TV and how we help over 100 real estate investors currently run their TV commercials and how they are having success too. I've been doing TV commercials for my business for well over a decade, so I have tons of knowledge on what works and what does not work when it comes to TV, as well as other forms of motivated seller marketing. By the way, if you wanna book a call with me and my team at any time, there's a button on the page that you can do so. We will walk you through a plan and tell you what TV commercials cost in your market. You know, you can absolutely try this on your own. I've seen many try and not succeed, but instead of you trying on your own and wasting your money, what if you had a formula where you could streamline the process and make sure you are not throwing money down the drain? For instance, we have Dakota, a client of ours, tell us that he was running TV commercials on his own in his market, which usually surprises me because not many people can even get on the air. We were able to get him over 10 times more commercials for the same ad spend. Here's the actual review that he left us on Google. He says, we were working with a local channel that we had somewhere around 80 commercials a month and 10X, which is our company, helped us to get over 800 commercials for the same cost. So you have to know what stations to call. You have to know what shows to be on. You have to be able to script a 30 second commercial to get your point across and you have to have a good call to action. Not to mention, do you drive them to a call or do you drive them to a website? And there are a lot of other details you need to know if you want to get results. There is an advantage here because of the high barrier of entry because of all the details that are hard to figure out. But if you can figure this out, you have a huge competitive advantage over the competition. We have all this data from decades of experience running TV commercials and our real estate investing clients alone are spending over $1 million a month, which is giving us data that no one else has. Speaking of clients, you probably know a lot of our clients as we service some of the biggest names in the business. Ex-NFL player Dean Rogers, for instance, Eric Brewer, the King Innovations, who's done over 3,000 deals, Lee Arnold from Kogo Capital, as well as Josh and Tiffany High, who do 20 to 30 deals a month. We've also worked with Ron Legrand, and here's me with a picture of Zeke on set. So I want to take a moment to share with you 10X TV. It is the buzz in the real estate investing world right now. And guess what? I was one of the first to do TV commercials over a decade ago. If you want high quality, motivated seller leads that are asking you to do business with you instead of you reaching out to them, go to claimmymarket.com and we will show you our TV launch formula. We have the shows and stations that we know work. We have the scripts that we know work. We've basically taken the formula that I've created over the last decade plus that I've been doing TV commercials, and we are now plugging it in for over 100 real estate investors around the country. And if you want to be one of those as well, reach out to us at claimmymarket.com. If you want to 10X your marketing, go and apply and see if we have a spot in your market. Now back to the video. I know what you're thinking, TV is dying, but that is further from the truth. Here's a study of adults 50 plus, lower income, again, this is our demographic, and it shows that 97% of these people watch TV on some sort of platform. And if you look there, 38% of people said television was the most influential thing when making a decision 
and the next one was direct mail at 7%. And look at this, adults 50 plus, same demographic, less than $100,000 in household income, and homes valued less than 300,000, 141.5 minutes of TV watch per day. And when asked what triggered an online search, 47% of people, almost half the people said that TV ads triggered them to go online and search for that business. This shows you how powerful TV is and that people are not only watching TV, but it's really impacting their buying decision. TV is not as expensive as you would think, and you don't have to be a huge business. You would be surprised actually at how affordable TV is. And you can compare it to direct mail, for instance. So to get 1,000 impressions from direct mail, you need to spend around $500. For TV, it is closer to $5 to hit that same 1,000 people. That's right. Direct mail is 100 times more expensive per impression. And guess who's watching TV? Older demographic and lower income. Who are our customers? Older and lower income. That is one of the biggest reasons TV is perfect for real estate investing. I'll wrap this up by giving you the top five reasons that TV is so great. Number one, credibility. The credibility you get from TV, you cannot get from anything else. When you are on TV, you are a celebrity in their eyes. There is no need to work for their trust. You already have it. Number two, little to no competition. Because of the barrier of entry, there are not many people that are on TV. And just because they are on TV does not mean they are doing it right and that they will last. I've seen many investors come and go, and I am the only investor in my market that is consistently doing TV. Number three, high ROI. While my attorney says I can't dive too deep into this, I can tell you that a good return is $3 for every dollar you spend, and I get way more than that. In fact, one of our best years was $10 back for every dollar we spent, and our clients are seeing the same success and sometimes even better results than we are getting. Number four, high return on time. As you get further along in this business, you may realize that this may be one of the most important things. Once TV is set up right, you usually don't need to touch it for six to 12 months or even more. We have some clients that are running their same TV commercials from over two years ago because they're still producing at a high level. And number five, TV helps all other forms of marketing because when people know you're on TV, they trust you more and more likely to call you from your postcard, Google ads, and other forms of marketing. And I haven't even touched on how TV can help you raise more money, how the quality of leads are so high, and that TV helps you close deals easier because of that trust factor. Our clients tell us they close one deal out of every five to 10 leads, and we have seen the same in our business. While with outbound channels, you may have to get 50 to 100 leads to get that same deal. Imagine the time and energy it saves not having to go through so many leads. Again, marketing methods have come and gone, but TV has been the pillar to my whole business for well over a decade. No other marketing method can give you all the things that I mentioned here and so much more. I would hope that by now you understand what TV can do for you, and I suggest you book a call with us to see how we can develop a game plan for you and give you data on what the ad spend would be in your market so you don't have to figure that out. Don't take it from me. Here are some videos from some of our clients and what they say about us. We're easily 551 to 576,000 in total profit. First 30 days on TV, I feel like we crushed it. We're getting your double digits in the first six weeks. We'll be on point to do over a million dollars in revenue from just TV alone. I don't think you can go wrong with TV because the leads will be there. The ability to attract is is certainly there with television. $30,000 profit or near $30,000 profit in two weeks is, is pretty good. And based on that, it makes me want to continue to do it. TV ads, you set it and forget it. That message is getting out there that who you are, uh, what you do and how you can help people. They know that if you're on television, you're putting yourself out there like that, that you're legitimate business. It gives you a little bit more of that celebrity status and professional appearance. I don't watch TV. Like I don't watch cable or local news or anything I, I stream right so i'm not seeing my commercials but you know my wife and i are painting the exterior of our house and i go into the paint store and the guy's like i know your voice oh my gosh you're the guy on so he must watch the same news every single day right he's like you're the guy on or i go to like to the restaurant and they're like oh my gosh i see you every day i have coffee with you every morning let's get into results there's two other flips that we have 
in inventory. One we just got access to today and another one we're getting access to in um, two weeks with a sheriff lockout. Those are going to be anywhere combined to about 125 to 150,000 in profit. Wow. So you, you put that all together, we're easily 551 to 576,000 in total profit. So over half a million bucks. I, I love anything that is inbound, meaning that that the customer is calling you because they already have that need and they had the thought of selling their home already on their mind. So I love inbound marketing because they're calling you. Um, so there's, a, you know, there's already this, like we're not so desperate. We're not in that needy, desperate situation. Being willing to pay for speed and being impatient as an entrepreneur, I'm, I'm as impatient as it gets. And so I, I didn't want to wait around or figure out how many years it was going to take me to be good enough to get into that market. I knew this was the way to do it. And so um, I was willing to just pay for the speed, jump in with two feet. And if you have that mindset, like I did, I don't think you can go wrong with TV because the leads will be there. And then it's just, it's up to you to uh, to be you know decent enough. And I'm still learning. I'm such a rookie, you know, just trying to be as humble as I can and learn as much as I can. The first day that was set to go live, I texted or emailed you and Drew. I said, hey, did our commercial go live today? Because because I'm getting calls. <laughs> we got three calls that morning, I think. You know, I was like, this is crazy. There's no way this is really happening that fast. And so they did and they have. Uh, they've continued. We're getting at least a call a day. I don't know exactly what it is now, but it, it was, that was two weeks ago that we looked at it and we were going for 30 days and we had gotten 30 leads, you know, 30 phone calls to go through. Yeah, I think the key uh, for me is to be patient. You know, a lot of times people need to see, you know, it's like with direct mail, they need to see that you're going to be consistent. And I think the commercials just sometimes they've got to catch the people at the right time and they've got to see that you're in it for the long haul. And I think just being patient you know it works so there's it's not like there's that much difference in the markets and so for me it was just hey let the system do its job and i need to do my job and things will work out and look honestly you're gonna have to go through the videos that are going to show you how to prep for your commercial it may take a half hour and then you're going to have to go to a studio that we're going to set up we're going to schedule for you we're going to have everything prepared and that may take an hour of your time. Like, all right, so I can reasonably say that I'm gonna spend two hours of my time to get this campaign rolling. So this program was super easy. Everything was provided within a guide and framework and the education component was wonderful because I, I understood uh, the objectives and it made getting in front of the camera, uh, in front of a green screen, a lot easier because I knew what was expected of me and I didn't have to attempt this by trial and error. And like, that's the most important value add is that a lot of the testing on what to say, when to say it, how to say it, and the creatives um, for the commercial itself, it's a winning formula. But working with a media buyer was fantastic. It was simple. I really didn't have to do anything except sign up, work with you. Drew called me, he emailed me, we talked. Uh, and um, then he did all the background work to, to get it on the TV station that we needed to in the area that would be most beneficial. Oh, I, I would love to keep TV and just kind of increase our marketing uh, spend. So far, TV has just been the best, it's been quality. With TV ads, I mean, you, you reach a whole lot more uh, you know, households, you know, a whole lot more people. You send a direct a piece of, of mail, it's gonna go to one house. Right and you're paying to send it to that one house. You make a cold call, it's gonna be a call to just one house. TV ads, you set it and forget it. That message is getting out there that who you are, uh, what you do and how you can help. The credibility factor when you're speaking with someone who's seen you on TV, there's no questions around, can you close? Who are you? Can you, can you give me some local references? You know, they know that if you're on television and you're putting yourself out there like that, that you're legitimate business. So it definitely helps the credibility in the market. When people see us on TV, number one, they are like, wow, okay, so this company has enough money to market on TV. Yeah, we have an A plus better business rating. They can go and look at our website. And then when they, by the time they call us, it's it's a done deal right in the sense of credibility we started tv in august they're probably the highest quality that i've seen uh throughout all of our marketing channels which is why we doubled the budget whereas for tv you're usually the only call at least for for what i found in my market it seems like when i get a phone call for a tv ad after that conversation i know for a fact it's, it the deal's happening with me the rapport you instantly have from a tv ad versus say like an inbound text call or an inbound mailer 
it's it's probably like a month worth of rapport. You'd have to build with a mailer or with a someone you know as a uh, just a random text caller because they're like, hey, why'd you send me mail? Who are you? Like, what is this? And then in my market with the TVs, it's like, hey, you're the TV guy. Like, it's so awesome to be able to talk with someone who's on TV. Calling somebody out of the blue, not knowing who you are or anything. I'd say it gives you a little bit more of that celebrity status and professional appearance. You know, you, you already have that credibility where they see your face, they understand what you do in a, from the 30 second commercial, and they kind of feel like they know you because now they saw you and now you get on the phone with them and you really build that credibility and rapport way better.